What's good, Humble Squad? It's your boy, Humble Ziggy. We back in here with another Nerdcore reaction for y'all. And sorry if I look like I'm a. If I look a little bit oily. A little oily and such, cuz. Look, at the time of this recording, it's 11 19 a.m. I literally just woke up like minutes after this. So, sorry if I look a little bit oily and such, but regardless of that. We here with Peso P, Finesse King, official lyric video, One Piece. Now, judging by how the thumbnail looked in it, be, apparently it's a bug, it's another buggy rap. Cause, let's face it, with Buggy, Buggy the clown from One Piece, you can say he's more of a finesser. You can, I can definitely see why he's known as the finesser. Cause, nigga, ain't, the nigga is just savage with it so and hey shout out to everybody who was at NPC man I wish I could be it's like this I wish I could be at one of those conven conventions one day and meet some of y'all nerdcore artists god damn it I wish I could but it is what it is man hope that one of these days there's one in Florida and I could go to one so yeah but shout out to everybody who enjoyed themselves, all the nerdcore artists who performed and went there. Hope I can meet y'all one day at another convention. But either way, we about to check this out. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And without further ado, let's get in the video. How much was your hold up? What you just said? How much was your pack? Is that shit magic? I'm a man. I'm a man. Her head plug was taxing. Cause normally with it's like this with the one piece, the government they be giving a lot of taxes to some of these pirates. Cause they feel like cause that's the only way that pirates and the government could agree. That if anyhow they were to get money, if the pirates got money, the, if some of it goes to the government. That is how it is. And. My shit is sloppy, but hold up. Peace up his body and peace out the lobby, cause with Buggy, with with his type of power, it goes into pieces. One thing you always gonna get with Peso, pure straight energy, cause he's from, cause he from Florida, and you know how Florida people here are. I know technically I live in Florida and all, but let's face it. I'm Jamaican straight through and through. If y'all saw from my recent reaction, I had my Jamaican flag like it's literally right here. So yeah, but yeah, I was born and raised in Jamaica. I had moved to Florida back in 2014, so I technically wasn't born here. But one thing I gotta say with Florida people, y'all are crazy. <laughs> y'all find different ways to get lit. <laughs> Tell him my shit is sloppy when my shit is popping. Yeah. A lot of people wanna say Peso's music is oh offbeat. Nah nigga. Some of his music that be like this is his style and it works for him. Drop a little tweet and you said it's dissolving. 
Okay, who is nigga? I I know damn well that ain't a sh that is not a sh that is not a reference on the on the show or at Buggy. That tweet is something. You said yeah, yeah. you say you solid, just go stand and talk, but I drop a little yeah. But I drop yeah, a little tweet and your set is dissolving. That's gotta be a shot at somebody. Wait, hold up. Is Pace Pace taking shots at somebody? Hold up. Funny, cause I'm writing shit about a clown. While surrounded by clowns, I got muses for I got muses for all of this. He taking shots at somebody. Or some people. It's funny, they try to pivot, they sound If it was anybody but me, I would be pissed off, pissed off, nauseous. Nah, yeah. This is definitely a shot at somebody. This gotta be a shot at somebody or s some people. Cause he, cause the fact that he said that even though he's rapping about a clown, he's surrounded by clowns. Who the clowns? Who the clowns in this nerdcore he's talking about? Hold up, hold up, whoa, 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 whoa. First of all, rest in peace to yeah, he taking shots at somebody. He is taking shots at somebody. Young Peso is freaking with Peso, yeah. Like you said, if it wasn't him, if he was anybody but himself, let's face the fact, there will be there will be a lot of people because let's face it, I've said it before and many others too. With Peso, he has paved the way for like the unorthodox style in Nerdcore. Cause there may there may have been a lot of other people trying to do their little thing of it and such, try to do it unorthodox. And nine times out of ten, it a little bit works, but not all the time. With Peso, there's like a w method of how he does his. So, Peso, if you see this, bro, shout out to you, because let's face it, in this nerdcore community, you, you probably, you was the first, I can, from when I learned about it on that vlog with Otaku Underworld and such, I learned that you was the first person to do the A ad lib in nerdcore and with the unorthodox style. Let's face it, you was the main reason for unorthodox style in nerdcore. You kind of brought that in. So shout out to you. That is not. He he said. <laughs> I get he was trying to rhyme it and all. That, but the fact that he tried to rhyme little body with schwabity, but you see how he said. You hear how he said schwabity. Listen to how he said schwabity. I get that. That's fun. That's a fun little way of pairing 
playing with the syllables, but listen to how he said Shawadi's name. Just trying to ride that's nobody. Like that's, that's, that's another little body. <laughs> Double cup, pink in my cup, Shabadi. <laughs> if sure. I don't know damn well, and I know damn well Schwabity is gonna react to this, cause knowing him, and once he hear that, he gonna either feel so, he gonna feel like a, he gonna laugh at that way how he's trying to put right on his name. Oh look. Touch it, we gon' send him to the lobby. Touch it, we gon' send him to the Talk it, shut it, shut it, shut it. Touch it, we gon' send him to the lobby. I don't listen to you rappers, you copy. I cannot fuck with you rappers, you're sloppy. You ain't hard body. Talk like a female, stop that shoddy. Look at a rocky. I caught retail, plus it ain't got me. Pack in the mail, put it up proxy. Damn, now my dick is a poppin'. Santa Claus ain't gonna stop it. I like it, I copy. Me and my boys from the tropics. White thing, we always been a topic. We for the That's me and Mark. And G's. And you know, Omar. Oh. <laughs> yeah. That boy was just straight up talking his ish. He must have had, like, straight up. I feel like he was taking shots at somebody or at some people. Cause goddamn, this did this didn't feel like your ordinary. Well, it felt that your it had it unorthodox, but it had like a target. Cause that's one thing with peso is that, like you just said, if he wasn't, if he was anybody but himself, he would. I would be pissed off too. Cause nigga, I'm not. I don't want to be known as the same, like being the same, calling the like. Basically saying not advancing more or don't have my own style. I would be like simply following the leader type of way. So with Peso, I'm glad that he has his type of style. That nobody can try to... Because the old saying goes is always duplicated. How? I forgot, but it's basically... It's always like try to... Do like this, try to like follow it and such, but nothing can be the original. It's something like in the lines of that. But yeah, shout out to Young Peso P, Mr. Drunk Monk himself. Shout out to Schoolface for that, for that nickname for him. Cause let's face it, the man is the man is none like nobody. Is He's just that. <laughs> but yeah, y'all let me know what y'all thought about this in the comments below. It's been your boy Humble Ziggy signing out. Stay positive and keep the vibes up. Let go.